cute, you guys. Ooh, yes, that is really cute. So, like I said. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we have a wig by It's a Wig. The name of it is Asia and I have it in this beautiful honey brown. This color is so pretty. Um, it does come with like a frontal on it. Um, this is a wig on. You guys, I put this wig on and um, it was just gorgeous. I could not believe how I've gotten into browns more. Now this video was recorded um, at the end of December 2020 and um, I'm just now posting it. But this hair is gorgeous. It is still available um, for sale on most of the sites and it's not not that expensive so I went ahead on to cut the lace off now the lace that comes on this is almost like the HD um, transparent lace I did go in and put just a little bit of powder on there what I'm showing you guys here is just my um, bowl hole I like to use my bowl hole liquid gold um, you just put a little bit on and it'll last you a couple days I actually wore this wig like the whole time I think I was on vacation maybe like three or four days um, over the um, New Year's holiday so what I'm doing is I'm just showing you how I'm just going to lay it down now the hairline on this is a little bit dense you guys you can go in and you can pluck it I just went ahead on and threw, threw this wig on it's like a throw and go because of the curls that's in here you don't really see the hairline that much but if you want to see the hairline um, then of course you can go ahead and pluck it or you can just pluck where you're going to be parting it at so that it'll have more definition on that side so what I loved about this wig you guys was the color of this wig this wig color is beautiful like I said it's honey brown you do get browns in there you get some reds you get um, a little bit of blonde in there as well it's just a really pretty blend and then you get like maybe a number eight or a number six something like that blended in with a number four and all of it together is absolutely gorgeous I end up making the hairline work for me I will tell you, like I said before, that the hairline is a little bit dense. So if you're a person that's like really, really, you know, strictly want this to be like perfect, then yeah, you're going to have to like pluck it and all that kind of stuff. But if you're somebody who's like, listen, I just want my partner area okay and I want to get me some color, you're going to like this wig. So um, I went in, like I said, and just used the bow hole on both sides. Now the lace did lay down really good. What I love about using the bow hole is that once I put it down and I just blow dry just a little bit and it gets tacky, it does hold it down pretty good and then I don't have the mess so much of of the spray usually I'll go back in with the spray at some point and use it and that is the um, bed head but most of the time this here that bowl hole it will just get it down and it'll hold it so that you know you're able to go in and you're able to work on that hairline so as you guys can see I pretty much molded the hairline um, how I wanted it and I put down some edges just on the side that I was going to put behind my ear. Um, what I ended up doing up to that top, I wanted it to be like nice and flat. So I ended up using my um, blow dryer and just some spray on that part. Now I'll tell you, I like the hairline on this and I think that it's not bad um, and everything. But I feel like once I parted it and got on the inside, I did have a harder time seeing the parting area. So I did have to go in and I had to put powder in there um, just to be able to see the parting area. So I did go around the hairline like I usually do with a little bit of baby oil that was just to get rid of some of the spray and product that's around there um you get some of that build up so that's all i did there and then i just went in with my powder just to kind of bring everything together um um you know bring everything together and make it look good so like i mentioned i love the wig i think the color is super super pretty only thing is it's just on the inside here you're going to see i had to add some powder once i add the powder bada bing the parting area like comes to life and it's like really pretty. So um, up close and personal, the parting area does look a little screen door-ish. I do want to tell you guys that. So you may want to use some of the faux scout methods that are um, here on um, YouTube. Okay, you guys, so this is the final look for this wig, and Miss Asia is everything. She's absolutely gorgeous. So let me show you guys the stock card one more time. This is the stock card that comes along with the wig, and like I said, it is in the co color Honey Brown. Absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous color. So loving it. So after I had came out with a couple different colors, and I started to get into some of the brown, like cinnamon brown. I forget the name of the other brown they came out with, but this one here puts me in mind of that, except to me, um, it has a lot more gold in it. So let me pull the hair, all the hair to the front so you guys can see. You see how you have like all this blonde that comes underneath here, then it goes into the chocolate color, but you still get some of the red on top. I do like the way that's in here. It gives it something 
but it's not like too much. It's not, but if you want to get curls, you can kind of run your hands through it. Now, I did go in and put a little bit of baby oil on my hands and rub it through it. That's just so that the fibers would not stick together one and they wouldn't get like matted. And I think that worked. I'm loving the hairline on this. Now, I'll tell you guys, I had to cut, I put a hole, <laughs> I called myself plucking this wig and I was like, what am I doing? What am I doing in my life? I called myself plucking the wig and when I went to pluck like right in the front of it, I put a hole. So what I did is I just cut into it a little bit more and I'm going to let you guys see, I just cut into it a little bit more and I think it came out even better. That hairline, not too heavy. It does feel a little bit weighted. And I think that's just because of this frontal up here. Like this piece here is kind of heavy. Here it's versatile as well. You can pull it up into a couple different styles. It says that it has 5G true um, HD transparent lace. I think that the front is good. I'm not sure back up in here because I had to add way too much powder. Side here. I had to add powder all up in there. Hair's are really pretty. I love it behind my ears. Now what I'm gonna do is some more love TV. I've been following her for years, way before I even had a channel. So she has a business and I ended up ordering a couple different hair clips from her business. So let me show you guys those. I was going to put some on. I may put a few into the hair. Since we are just having like a total relaxed <laughs> wig review today um so i got a couple of them from her this one here says saucy so i end up getting that one and then i got two of those so i got two saucies and i got one soleil okay and then i got one that says empress which i want to say that is like her name of her business I like this one because it's gold and I like it because it's a clip. It's like a long clip. So I like that one. And then I got another one that says a bomb. <laughs> so I like that as well. Okay. I don't even know how many I got because like I was watching, I think I was watching Deanna Marguerite. And I think she mentioned that she had gotten some from her. So I just went ahead on and ordered. I'm always about support and I just love the YouTube community. So let's see. I think I put a gold one in this one because of the color of the hair. I think the gold would look nice with it. Ooh, girl, you got me excited. I was going to say I can clamp this side up more. There we go. Mm-hmm. That's cute, you guys. Ooh, yes, that is really cute. So, like I said, I picked up a couple of those from her hair barrettes or just hair accessories. I will definitely leave her um, information in the description box below. So, thank you guys again for watching. I just wanted to give you guys another close up of this a hairline. It looks really, really good. I will definitely leave a link below for you guys to pick up the wig. Thanks again for stopping by the channel. If you have not subscribed, consider subscribing to the channel. Um, I will see you, ladies and gents, in my next video. Bye.